of Vlogmas. Whew, look at us on day two. Um, so I have some winter mini photo shoots today that I, um, I think I have three families that we're doing. I was up really late last night editing, but you know what? We're at it again today. So I'm gonna get ready for those and um, yeah, we'll see what else the day brings. Well, I mean, you already started helping me, but cleaning is always first and foremost on the list. Tiny home life is dirty. But you don't, you don't have to really clean a tiny home. There's not much going on, right? Oh, of course. <laughs> that's that's the, the the view everyone has. That oh, it's tiny. You never have to clean it. You live your entire life in a small space. It gets dirty fast. Or if you do have to clean it, it doesn't take long. That's the other thing. But the thing is, you're cleaning way more often, like you said. Way more often. Yeah. So, yeah, we're trying to make sure that we clean every morning when it comes to the tiny home, and especially with Christmas season, we want to have a nice area to live in in yes. a workspace, too. Totally. So, cleaning is the first thing on my docket. <laughs> there you go. And coffee. Who doesn't like a man that cleans? Right? This is like pornography for some people right here. It is. Right there. I get to live with that. Yep. Getting ready to go? Yeah, I think I got all my stuff. Photo shoot time, hey? At least it uh, snowed. It's so nice outside right now. You gonna be gone? Um, four-ish. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'll see you when you get home. Have a good day, babe. Thanks, you too. Good luck, have fun. Not that you need it. Thank ya. See you later. Okay, she's gone, let's go. Okay, with Nicole being gone, I didn't tell her, I'm decorating the house for Christmas. So when she gets home, everything's gonna be complete Christmas in our tiny home. So let's get everything together and start decorating our tiny home. side effects of living in a tiny home is you have less stuff. So when it comes to things like Christmas, all of our decorations are in one box. Whether that's an upside or a downside, I mean, that's up to you. But for us, it's a bonus. It's an upside. So let the Christmas decorating commence. So I've been decorating like mad and the place is a disaster right now, but decoration is done. I'm gonna clean up and I'm gonna show you guys, this is, I'm gonna show you Nicole's reaction when she gets home, which should be not too long. I got about an hour to make sure this is all cleaned up and the light's starting to go down. So it's gonna be like perfect when she gets home. I think Nicole's home. Who's home? 
Who's there? No! Who's there? No! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. 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 Look at this. Wow. We're decorated. Oh my gosh. Wow. That looks so good. Are you just acting up for the camera, or do you actually think so? No, I think so. We um, changed a lot up this year. I like it. Wow. Yeah, I did. Well, the idea was I really wanted to show how you can do a lot with just a little, like, wow. Christmas bulbs. You can just hang them everywhere. Well, and, like, look at that. That's cute. Just a little piece of a yarn tying a bow over a picture. Huh. Good job. Thank you. I love it. I'm glad you like it. Yeah, it looks super good. I like the pumpkin still, you know. Well, we had before. to add add the vibe in there. Did you notice the uh, antlers? Oh gosh, I didn't know. <laughs> had to do it. Huh. So that's where we're going to have our Christmas cards. We already have one already. And uh, yeah. Wow. Well done. Thank this you. This is exciting. So does it feel more like Christmas has started, or does it feel like it started with Vlogmas? Vlogmas. Vlogmas feels like Christmas started, rather mm -hmm. than the decorations? Yeah, this adds to it though, for sure. It really does. This is amazing. You did so good. Thank you. I do want to say and clarify, I decorated because Nicole doesn't like to decorate. <laughs> I don't, okay, I love the decorations up, but I don't love putting them up for some reason. I, it's and not, you're very creative with it, though. I mean, you can be, too. You just don't like to put the energy into it because it's it overwhelms you. Whereas I'm a more of a water off my back kind of person, and it takes a lot to really overwhelm me. I so. guess. Well, this time of year, too, is usually I'm already a little bit overwhelmed. That's true. That's true. <laughs> Fair enough. With my work schedule, I'll just clarify. Yeah. Another thing I do want to add is the other day we were actually talking about our dog, Honey. We did some math because oh. Honey is an SPCA rescue dog. We did some math and we figured out that Honey was given up for adoption on December 21st of 2022. Last year. And we adopted her in February 4th on 2023. Yeah. So she was given up and in the adoption shelter for Christmas. So we're going to make sure that we give her an extra special Christmas. A damn good Christmas. Mm -hmm. We um, already have a few presents for her. <laughs> she's going to love it. And she was already sniffing at the dog's stocking already quite a bit, which I made sure I put like down here at dog level. So cute. Yeah, you missed my reaction to that. That was like my was heart good. just melted. <laughs> so it's going to be a good Christmas. And I think this just kicked it into that gear. Yeah. Okay. It looks lovely in here. It's cozy. It is. Cozier. Yeah. Uh, so tiny home living is, is pretty badass. Just going to say that. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah.